He lived Blighton, the famous five secret seven, five on a treasure island. You have probably read her books as a child or a teen. But how much do you know about her? She wrote over 700 books and sold over 600 million copies. And it's still selling. That's a lot. But did she do that all single-handedly? What was the controversy? She had a parallel profession too? Oh, and a secret identity. Today, I'm going to tell you some very facts about our dear London author. This is Anvi and you are watching We Kids Media. Hashtag We Kids Can Do It. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Fact 1. A planner or a go-with-the-flow kind of person. Which one was Blighter? She claims to have written all her books on a typewriter perched on her lap and never planned them beforehand. She let her imagination take her from the beginning paragraph to the concluding word. Can you guess how many words of a publishable book she wrote in a day? 10,000! Fact 2 Being one of the most famous authors as well as one of the most read ones, the volume of her books and how fast they were produced made her really successful. But did she do it all single-handedly? Well, at least we hope so. But there have been rumours of her having ghost workers and helpers. But Enid Guyton firmly denied the charges. So, I guess we'll never know. Fact 3. What occupation wheels into your mind when you think of Enid Blyton? Author, right? But what if I told you she didn't begin as an author, instead as a teacher or governess? And let me let you in on a little secret. Enid was head girl in school and liked all of her subjects. Well, at least most, because like some of y'all, she didn't like maths as well. Fact 4. Enid Blyton's first book, Child Whispers, came out in 1922. It was a book of poetry. At this point of time, she was still working as a teacher and only wrote in her free time. Fact 5. Mary Pollock. That name sound familiar? Well, it's probably no Mary and just Enid. Yes, Brighton at times wrote under the pen name Mary Pollock. She had a secret identity. Before we end, let's play a little game of put a finger down. Spread out the fingers of your palm and I will say a book, series or book. And if you read it, then put a finger down. Let's see how many Enid Blyton books have you read. First, let's start easy. Secret 7. Famous 5. The Magic Far Away Tree Collection. Have you read the Mallory Tars? And finally, the iconic Noddy. If you made a fist, well then I have to admit, you are an Enid Blyton fan. If you didn't, then please go check out the books you haven't read yet. And let us know in the comments if you liked it. Till then, stay tuned for more tidbits. Bye! Yeah, good. Starting part of your show. Start. Yes, yes. 4, 3, 2, 1, start.